Just one glimpse at this building on East Main Street and like Dr. Clark White, a.k.a. Deacon Blues. If you're watching Channel 12 News, you're listening to the best in news in Chattanooga, Tennessee. You'd want a closer look. I was actually driving by and just saw it and pulled over and uh, was quite excited about it. Excited because the Chattanooga native has close ties to the subject of the artwork. Samuel L. Jackson. I met Sam when he was about seven or eight years old. We met his little boys at the Y on Park Avenue, and our friendship has developed since that time. Though he was born in Washington, D.C., the Academy Award-nominated movie star grew up in the scenic city from around age two. From what I know about him from reading, um, his story is a really good metaphor for the downtown area, which I live in, and I guess for Main Street, too. So artist Kevin Bate thought his likeness would be a fitting image for this mural. You know, started off a little rough, had some stumbles, had some falls, but then turned it around and was very, very successful. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I break your concentration? And so I thought he'd just be a, a good, a good person to watch over the street. And despite that huge success, this is the only place you'll see anything marking Jackson's connection to the city. I do wonder why he doesn't get more attention here in Chattanooga. I would say he's one of our most famous sons. It got us wondering too, especially when we saw the note someone spray painted on the mural. Samuel, come home. We're sorry. Signed, Chattanooga. That's something his longtime friend would like. Well, I'd love to see him come home. I'd love to see him come home and be recognized. I'd love to see him come home and get his just due. Dr. White says Sam's not adverse to homecoming, and he's not angry with the city either. Do I look like I can help you? It's news Missy Crutchfield's happy to hear. It would be very meaningful for me as the administrator of this department that has education, arts and culture and a film commission to be part of recognizing Mr. Jackson, as well as as many people as possible. Like I In said. the meantime, this recognition, though temporary. I had just returned from being with Sam in New York when I saw it, so I sent him a picture of it. And he was quite elated about it. But we you know we were both disappointed when we found out they're going to tear the building down. But we want to celebrate him anyway. Is very much appreciated. In Chattanooga, Nordia Epps, WDEF News 12.